Hello everyone, today my research topic is Selective Kernel Rest Attention Unit for Deep Learning for generating the decorrelation mask with application to Tandemax interferograms. As we know, the decorrelation is one of the main limitations for INSER. Masking decorrelated pixels is crucial for retrieving information from SAR interferograms. However, for traditional masking methods, no matter manually drawing masks, or setting a single coherence threshold to mask decorrelations are all infeasible due to their low accuracy and uh, the damage to wired faces. Here we treat the decorrelation mask problem as a segmentation task in computer vision field. Therefore, we propose a deep learning segmentation network, we call it MaskNight, for generating decorrelation masks and apply it to Tandemax interferograms. We conduct several experiments to determine the training strategy and the parameters of the network, including the sample size, batch size, loss function, and uh, the downsampling scheme to optimize the network performance. And uh, afterwards, we compare the performance of the mask night with other classical segmentation networks including the RFCN, REST Unite, and uh, Deep Life V3 Plus network. Our evaluation metric showed that the MaskNet outperforms the best, the best performance of other segmentation networks and also possesses the fastest inferring speed, which is at least 50% faster than other segmentation networks. And as at last, we applied uh, our mask night to Tandemax interferograms covering the, the, the metropolitan region of Wuhan in China. For this region, the decorrelations are mainly caused by lakes and the rivers and evenly distributed in the city. Many bridges across the water bodies complicated the situation. So uh, manually generating a mask for the whole interferograms becomes extremely difficult and even infeasible. And we also try to set different coherence stretch holes to mask out the correlation regions, but it's difficult to strike a balance between mask out the correlation pixels and keeping valid faces because of the wide coherence range of the ground objects. However, our proposed mask night exhibits a clear and fine segmentation effect where it keeps the nearly all the valid faces of bridges and the lake banks when masking out the decorrelated regions. To conclude, the mask night shows promising results in effectively generating accurate masks, especially for dealing with those complex and tiny decorrelation regions. And we believe such networks can greatly improve the re reliability of the following instar procedure such as the face unwrapping and the reduced labors in the big data area of the insert. And um, that's all. Thank you for your listening.